Good afternoon my friends and happy Tuesday. It is the 1st of December but it is Vlogmas Day 2. I can see myself getting quite confused with that because we never usually start a day earlier than we really need to. But anyway, we'll deal with it. So yeah, welcome to Vlogmas Day 2. I hope you're all doing really well. I've just spent the morning editing the vlog from yesterday and I'm really happy with it. That's all now scheduled and ready just to go out into the world at 5 o'clock this afternoon. Today, what have I got planned? It's a warm day today. It's not as hot as what they said it was going to be at the moment. It's going to get up to about 37 to 40 degrees today. Sorry, I'm just touching my eye. Um, it's only about 28 at the moment, so it's it's okay sort of temperature to be doing things. Where was I going with this? I think today, before it gets too hot, I want to do another block of my Winterville quilts. This is the Winterville quilt that I was talking about yesterday. And if you watched a vlog from, oh, sometime a couple weeks ago, I think now, I explained that I wanted to do a, try and do, try and do a block a day of the Winterville quilt because I started it last year and it just didn't go anywhere. So we're going to attempt to get a lot more of this quilt done this vlogmas. Um, so I have one more snowflake block to make. I've done the middle block, this big middle block. I've done three of the snowflakes for the corners. I just have to do one more and then we're moving on to the next step. So we'll try and do that uh, uh, soon. I also need to edit the photos I took of my little wallets and put them on my Etsy site because people are asking where they are and I just haven't uploaded them yet. Other thing that we need to do today is... Oh, I also need to show you this. Um, is open the advent calendar and see what the first tea for the month is. I'll do that a little bit later on this afternoon. Because um, I'm not really quite in the mood for tea. Um, but I discovered <laughs> this amongst all my Christmas stuff. And it's something I want to show you. I've shown you before. I'm pretty sure you know what it is. Maybe. I don't know. But you'll see in a minute. But this is a lovely gift I got from my beautiful friend Aisha in the UK. She just knows me so well and sends me such beautiful things that I'm just so grateful for. And this is, I think, hands down, my favourite Christmas ornament. It is very fragile, which uh, which is why it doesn't go on our Christmas tree, because our Christmas tree is on our concrete tiled floor. And if this were to fall off our tree it would definitely smash and I'd be so sad but this is a beautiful glass blown bauble I'm pretty sure it's glass blown yeah um, by the Arabus Brothers so this is who it's by Arabus Brothers and it is this beautiful glass blown bauble and it has the sweetest little Winnie the Pooh in it and I just absolutely love it. I am a hardcore Winnie the Pooh fan ever since I was like 10 years old. I found this in my special Christmas stuff this morning and I'm like oh I gotta put that up somewhere in my sewing room because I just love it so much. So I think I've decided to do um, the next block in the quilt. You can see there are my lovely blocks I've done. This quilt is not going to fit on my design wall um, so something we're going to have to just figure out as we go. I also managed to put up my bunting on the wall as well this morning, which I'm very happy about. Let's get into making this block before it gets way too warm in here.
little block for the day is done. Big tick for that. Here she is. She's looking lovely. Let's pop it on the design wall with all the others. There we are. So we have our four corner snowflakes and our center. So tomorrow, hopefully, sometime, I'm at work tomorrow, so it'll have to be an evening sewing session. Uh, we'll start doing the next section of the quilt. I'm very excited. It's time to add some color to this lovely quilt. The next step is doing these stars around here. I think it's about one o'clock. No, it's actually quarter past one. I'm gonna go have some lunch and I don't know, see where the afternoon takes me. Oh dear, <laughs> it's, it's a little bit later on in the evening and I'm not in focus, but it doesn't matter. There's a nice lovely storm brewing outside. I thought while we do that, let's open the advent calendar because I want a cup of tea and this is a tea calendar. I almost don't want to open it because it's just like so pretty, but I think, actually, I don't even know how to open it. I'm going to require scissors. Mm -hmm. Okay, very nice. All right, are we ready? We're going to experience this together. Opening. Ooh, oh, oh, hey, puppy. Oh, we've got the dog in. I know puppy, it's scary. You said that. You're all right. Okay, Charlie doesn't like the thunder um, and when it's stormy so he comes inside he'll be all right he'll be all right puppy so on this side we've got all of the numbers hopefully you can hear me and on this side it has a list of all the teas that are in here as chaos reigns outside let's open number one I have to tell you this it smells so good smells really like spicy and aromatic and floral. Let's do number one because it is the 1st of December. Oh, oh, totally ruined it. What is it? Oh, it doesn't tell me. What is it? What is it? It's called gingerbread treat. Mmm. It smells a little bit like gingerbread, but very um, florally and spicy too. Let's see what it says on the back. Organic black tea with cinnamon, ginger, apple and cardamom. Ooh. So if it's black tea, that means I can have milk with it? We'll have to see. Alright, nice. Well, I'm going to go make a cup of tea and we'll give this a try. Alright, the craziness of that storm has now just died. Um, that was a pretty intense storm. It's not very surprising that we did get a storm like that because it's been a hot day today. And usually when it's a really hot day, you get a, a really big a nasty storm in the evening. During all that time, I've allowed my beautiful tea to brew. It smells delightful. I have added milk, so I don't know whether I should have or not. I think usually with black teas, you can add milk. I asked my mom, she's like, just give it a go and see what happens. So I'm like, all right. So it's been brewing for four to five minutes. That's what it recommended. And I'm the sort of person who leaves the tea bag in. You're gonna get as much flavor out of that tea bag as possible. And I'm also drinking it out of my beautiful caskets and Christmas mug. I love it. Anyway, let's try. Not bad. Not bad. It tastes like really weak hot crust buns <laughs> or like um, raisin toast. It is a very weak brew. Oh, I can't show you without spilling it. Um, but yeah, it's very weak. I usually like to have my tea a bit stronger than this. But it tastes nice. I wasn't sure whether I'd like it, but I, I like it. Hmm. I would have liked it to be just a little bit stronger but yeah it just tastes like hot cross buns really weak hot cross buns that is a definite win for me I'm gonna continue drinking my beautiful tea while I edit the photos for my little wallet listings for Etsy and they're actually gonna go up today or tonight hopefully oh just found fabric that I've been 
looking for? Oh, yeah, I've been looking for that. Oh, I should love that. You just find things. And just Anyway, so I've just spent the last couple of hours editing the photos for my little wallets. And I've now listed a few of them on my Etsy site. So if you are interested in uh, purchasing them, then they are now available on my Etsy shop. Uh, the link to that is in the description box below if you'd like to go check it out. The ones that I have listed as of tonight are the koala ones, the dumbo ones, snow white. I have three of the pushing mermaid ones and three of the pushing rainbow wallets and then I've also just put up this one as well this one is a limited edition there's only one in stock so if you want it then you have to go over and buy it because there's only one so at the moment only those are on my Etsy store I will be putting more on oh I've also got these two as well I've also got these two up there as well. I am going to be putting more up on my website soon. It's just I'm having a lot of issues with my computer at the moment. It's just going so slow and it's driving me insane. So, um, so I sort of, I've reached my level of patience with my computer tonight. So that's all I got done. Now I'm actually going to say good night because I'm going to edit this vlog tonight so I can schedule it to go out tomorrow because I'm at work all day tomorrow. So I won't get a chance to edit it like I do in the morning and then schedule it for the afternoon. Update on the tea. I drank pretty much most of it. I really enjoyed it. As I mentioned, it tasted like weak hot crust buns. I think it's because of all the cinnamon and spices in it. I'm looking forward to seeing what else is in this calendar. I'm, I'm really hoping that I will like most stuff in it because I'm not the biggest fan of like flavoured tea, like the herbal and floral type teas. I'm very much a black tea with milk tea lover. Although the only tea that I love that is flavoured is the Yorkshire Biscuit Brew Tea, which is like my favourite tea in the whole world. I will drink that every day, all day. I do like green tea and I do like green tea with lemon. That one's really nice. And peppermint tea. That's kind of like the only teas I sort of venture. So I'm interested to see if there's anything else in here that will sort of change my mind and and be really really delicious so i keep saying it but it just smells so nice thank you all so much for joining me today i do really appreciate the support and um just all of the lovely things you always say in the comments and just yeah just watching in and uh and joining in on the conversation i'm not 100 percent sure what i'm gonna do for the vlog tomorrow because i mentioned i am working it could just be like a hello i'm off to work and then we'll just do a block in the evening i don't know i don't know what tomorrow is going to be like but i'm not gonna worry about it because tomorrow is tomorrow's problem it's not today's problem so with that thank you so much for watching and i will definitely see you again tomorrow for vlogmas day three Bye!